Hi, and welcome back to Storytime. Today we have books all about the season that is now. Do you guys know what season it is? That's right, it's winter. But first we're gonna start with a little action rhyme. So put your hands up, get those fingers wiggling, and we're gonna wiggle our fingers up and wiggle your fingers down. You're gonna wiggle your fingers from side to side. Good job and then wiggle them all around. We're gonna wiggle our finger, fingers on our shoulders. Where are your shoulders? And we're gonna wiggle them on our head. We're gonna wiggle them on our tummy and then put them to bed. You're gonna put them in your lap. All right, good job. Our first book is called Winter is for Snow. Who likes to play in the snow? Winter is for snow. No. I don't think she likes snow. Winter is wonderful. Winter is for snow. Winter is for cold and damp. It must be 10 below. She is not a fan of winter. Is there anyone who doesn't like winter? See, because it's too cold? Winter is four fat snowflakes swirling as they blow. Glittering like dusty diamond, diamond dust, winter is for snow. Winter, I say no. Winter is for crystal trees that sparkle in the light. Winter is for silent streets beneath a cloak of white. Winter is for excellent. Come out and play with me. Winter is to stay inside. Please just let me be. Winter is for snowmen. Winter is for chums. Winter is for colored lights and holidays to come. Winter is for fabulous and winter is for snow. Winter is for lots of clothes and I don't want to go. We gotta wear a lot of clothes, right? We gotta stay warm in the winter. Winter is for snowball fights, for sledding down the hills. Winter is for skating rinks and speedy chilly thrills. Winter is for dazzling. Winter is for snow. Winter is, it's too cold. I'd rather watch a show. Winter is for mountainsides layered all in white, for skis and boards and going fast and zooming off in flight. Winter is adventurous. Winter is for snow. That really, that sounds really dangerous. I'll stay here down below. Winter is for mushing dogs across the Arctic ice. And if you meet a polar bear, you best, of course, be nice. Winter is for glaciers with walruses and seals diving in the icy sea for scaly fishy meals. Winter lasts all summer long, down here where the south wind blows. Penguins play on frosty peaks where brave explorers go. There's lots of fun things in winter, right? Winter is for all our friends together in the park. With sleds and forts and winter fun, we'll frolic till it's dark. Winter is for all these things? Is it really so? Winter might not be so bad. <gasps> oh, she's warming up to the idea of winter. Winter is for snow. Winter is for holidays and presents we will send. Winter is hot chocolate with family and friends. 
It likes hot chocolate. I love it. It's so tasty. Winter is for snug and warm. Winter is for glow. Winter is for wonderful. Winter, I love snow. All right, let's give a clap for our winter is for snow. And we are gonna do a felt board. And I need you guys to show me your five. And these are gonna be snowmen. So I'm gonna put my five snowmen up on the board. You can help me count, make sure I have everybody. We have one, two, three, four, and five. Okay. So these are our snowmen. We have five little snowmen standing in a, what are they in? They're in a line or a row. And they each have a, what are they wearing up top? A hat and a big red bow. Out came the sun. And what does sun do to snow? It melts it, right? It shone all day. And one little snowman melted away. How many snowmen do we have left now? We have one, two, three, four. Four little snowmen standing in a row, each with a hat and a big red bow. And then out came the sun, and it shone all day. And what happened to one of our little snowmen? And one little snowman melted away. How many snowmen do we have left now? We have one, two, three. Three little snowmen standing in a row, each with a hat and a big red bow. Out came the sun and it shone all day. And what happened? One little snowman melted away. How many do we have left now? We have two. Two little snowmen standing in a row, each with a hat and a big red bow. Out came the sun and it shone all day. What happened to one of our little snowmen? One little snowman melted away. Now how many do we have left? We have one little snowman standing all alone, alone with his hat and his big red bow. Out came the sun and it shone all day. What happened to our last little snowman? Our last little snowman melted away. Good job. Okay, we have another book. This one is called Winter White. Thinks there's a lot of white in winter, right? With all that snow all over. The color white can be fluffy and cold. A snowy wonderland is a sight to behold. Looks pretty, right? Sparkling white snowflakes cover the ground. She's gonna make a snow angel. And a sleeping white owl won't make a sound. What do owls usually say? They say, hoo, hoo. This one's sleeping. The bright white clouds stretch long and wide. And a cozy white igloo is a fun place to hide. <gasps> what do we have? We have another snowman. A chubby white snowman wears a black hat. And sticky white snowballs fly flat fast and go splat. White figure skates glide on the rink. And tasty white cream tops a nice warm drink. You put whipped cream on hot chocolate, right? It's so tasty. 
It's time to go in. The air has a chill. Can you look for more white from the windowsill? All right, let's give a clap. All right, good job. And we are gonna do another rhyme. So I'm gonna have you use your fingers and these are gonna be our snowflakes. And we have snowflakes, snowflakes falling down. So move your hands down. Falling, falling to the ground. Can you reach down, touch the ground? <gasps> Good job. Can you catch them on your nose? Touch your nose. And will they fall and touch your toes? Touch your toes. And then snowflakes, snowflakes falling down. Falling, falling to the ground. Touch the ground. Good job. I'm going to do that again. Ready? So we have snowflakes, snowflakes falling down, falling, falling to the ground. Touch the ground. Can you catch them on your nose? And will they fall and touch your toes? Touch your toes. Snowflakes, snowflakes falling down, falling, falling to the ground. Good job. We have one last book. And it's called Winter is the Warmest Season. Is winter warm or is it cold outside in winter? Let's see why they think winter is the warmest season. Winter is the warmest season. Most people think it's summer with long steamy days, but not me. My world is warmest in winter. Let's find out why. When winter comes, my jacket puffs warm with feathers and my hat grows ear flaps. My pants hide deep in fuzzy boots and my hands wear warm woolly sweaters. <gasps> what are those called that you put on your hands? Are they mittens? Yeah, we wear mittens in the winter to keep warm. When winter comes, summer's plants and animals sleep deep under thick blankets of snow. While the snowmen I build dance on top, wearing warm wraparound scarves. Do you know what it's called when animals to go to sleep for the winter? They're hibernating. When winter comes, my iced summer's milk turns to hot chocolate, and cold jelly sandwiches turn into grilled cheese. <gasps> Ooh, who loves grilled cheese? Hot soups, hot pies, and oven hot breads make winter the warmest for the inside of me. All our foods get real warm, right? Keep us warm, because it's chilly out. When winter comes, summer's cool fans hide in dark basements, while sleeping radiators awake to their dragon selves, banging and hissing and pouring heat out all through my house. When winter comes, cats sit on laps instead of windowsills. Even nights are warmer in the winter. Fires burn in fireplaces and candles burn in candle places. They're in candle holders. I think parties are warmer in the winter. And when summer's cool swims turn into winter's hot baths. I know my pajamas will grow big, warm feet. My bed is warmest in winter, piled high with blankets of plaid, blankets striped yellow and blue, and a starry quilt on top. In winter, bodies sit closer, books last longer, and hugs squeeze the warmest. Even friends are warmer. And in winter, 
When it's the very warmest, I close my sleepy eyes and I dream of summer. Just to cool me off. All right, let's give a clap. Okay, and then the craft for this week is going to be a nice winter hat. So, this is our winter hat. When you pick up your craft this week, we're actually moving the bin from outside the side door to up front, just in case it's snowy or weathering. That way we can keep it outside and still give it to you without getting the crafts all wet. And so you're gonna get this piece of paper with our hat. You're gonna color your hat in. You can cut it out if you want. And then you're also gonna get a cotton ball. So you're gonna take the cotton ball and you're gonna pull it apart and make it nice and fluffy. And then you're gonna put glue on the top and then you're going to glue on your cotton ball so you can see I have a nice fluffy top for our fun winter hat. Thank you for joining me for story time and I'll see you again next week. Have a nice week. Bye.